Oh, well, just how much does it mean to him and has it all sunk in yet? Well, we can ask him because he's here right now. Good morning. Good Welcome. Congratulations. Good morning. Well done. Well done. What a night. So, um, how, did it, how did it feel? How does it feel? Um, it still doesn't feel real. Really? It doesn't feel real that I'm sat here talking to you. It doesn't uh... feel real that I went at the NTA, you know. And Can you remember it or did it all go by in a blur? Um, the... The moment when I won the award, that 15 minutes after that was just a blur and I cannot remember any of it. Mm -hmm. What's crazy is, is that it was a year before, so the, almost a year to the day almost, that it was you got the job with Emmerdale. So within under a year to have that phone call saying, we'd like you to join the cast, to then walking up on stage and catching that award. I mean, it's, it's the stuff of dreams, really. I know. I mean, I can't... I believe it's been a short time, but, you know, the public really seems to have taken to my character and to me as an actor and to have that kind of recognition mm. and um, appreciation so early on in my career mm. essentially means the world to me. That's an incredible thing. I suppose, really, though, um... <laughs> I mean, it is always a big deal to win an NTA. I mean, it's a lovely moment. It's a great night. It's fantastic. You deserve it as a talented actor. However, um, you know, a big deal has been made out of it because you are the first disabled actor to, to win an award. Mm. Um, so it, it would be nice to get to a place where that's actually not the big deal. It's the fact that you are, you're a great actor yeah. and you won the award. It, yeah, I agree. I mean, I like to get into a position where we're you know, putting more disabled people in the industry, we're casting them in more, more roles because there aren't a lot out there. And I'm in my own work and in my kind of public stuff, like on Twitter, I'm trying to advocate for more yeah. disabled people. Well, you're a very powerful voice on uh, social media. You're using that, aren't you? Yeah. I, I mean, I think it's a great tool to use the kind of activism, speaking up and yeah. really getting your voice heard. When you, were, um, <clears throat> when you were at school, I mean, you did GCSE drama and acting was something that you always mm. wanted to do, but even then, sort of at that age, you were aware that there weren't so many roles for disabled yeah. actors, and, and yet it was still something you wanted to pursue mm -hmm. and change. Yeah, sure. I mean, I've always been aware there was a lot of barriers to it. You know, that's why I... I think it was drama school the first time and I didn't, but at the end of the day, I'm especially considering how kind of more open we're getting in the modern day, mm. I felt like now would be a good time to maybe kind of throw what I got into the fray and see, just see what happened. Yeah. I mean, I, wouldn't, I never thought, you know, that... I'd be getting the world all on Emmerdale. I was just like, hey. How was the audition? Oh, um, pretty scary. The first one was pretty scary. Yeah, and, um, uh, the first audition I had was with the producers. Yeah. And it was quite stern, you know, there's no expression whatsoever. They don't give you... You've no I mean, clue what you doing. But they don't give you any indication <laughs> of what's going on. And then um, the screen test was even more nerve-wracking because I was on set with Emma Atkins... Oh, really? Oh, God. ...doing a, doing a scene on Natural Emmerdale set with cameras around me and everything. So that was even more, even more intense. But Emma was lovely yeah. and, you know, I feel like we sort of bonded really well. Well, her reaction when you won the award, I mean, she was she was in tears. You can see how much that meant to her as well. I mean, like, he's, he's a great character. He's finally sort of been accepted into that family. But, you know, Emmerdale's an incredible soap. Mm. But to go in as part of that family in particular, to become a dingle, is just amazing. Yeah. I don't think I realised the implication of what that one when I first started <laughs> because um, I haven't really watched Emmerdale when I came into it. Oh, right. So I was just kind of getting to know. This is your first scene, first time, the first time we yeah. saw you. Let's have a listen. I need to see. But I, I don't want to say I'm mean, but um, I'm supposed to be meeting someone on this bench. OK, well, maybe I am as well. Who are you, carer? Anyway, I got here first. I don't have a carer. Are you always this group? No. Yes, actually, I am sometimes, quite often. Me too. We just sit here and, like, slag each other up, you know? 
Look, I'm really sorry, but can you just... I'm Ryan, your son. Da, ba, wow. Ba. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's like it's interesting. Yeah. 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 Interesting that um, that the point was made there. I don't have a carer. You don't have a carer. You're perfectly independent. You drive. You mm -hmm. live your own life. I think a lot of people mistook Glenn, uh, your best mate, when he yeah. carried you up on stage uh, on his uh, on his back. Um, he's here in the uh, in the studio today. How are you? Morning. Yeah. Good. How are you? Good oh, to see you. Nice yeah. to see you, Glenn. And a moment for you as well. I mean, it, we, can we watch back the moment when you went running up? We were just having a good. <laughs> time you know just James said he wanted me to go on stage if he won so you know I kind of said all right if you win I'm giving you a piggyback <laughs> got to the moment and I was like I'll be doing it and James was like yeah screw it that's so brilliant jumped you, on my back you drum together don't you, you both yeah 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 very good. good love it love um, it it's really really lovely to have you here it's first time here in our studio as yeah. well so really lovely thank Welcome you very thank much you. congratulations yeah well done you well, well done, done. Yeah. Emmerdale weeknights from 7pm on ITV as always thank you